Hello YouTube, this is my review of the soldering iron TS100 from Banggood. They kindly sent me this to review it. And since I like, since I work with soldering irons all day long and love all the displays, I figured I'd try this one. It comes in this box, you might have seen it. Here you can see the features of it. It has this is the updated model now. It has smart control, sleep mode and alert mode. Temperature range goes from 100 to 400 degree uh, degrees Celsius. Input voltage 12 to 20, 24 volts. Power 17 to 65 watts. And my unit came with two tips. One of them is here. This is the fine tip that I need for my soldering from the SMD parts and it also comes with this other tip which is the white tip. And it comes with an allen key and two extra screws. It also comes with a ground lead so you can ground your soldering iron to not destroy your sensitive parts it also comes with this small stand that I will show in a second let me put this away somewhere and here is the soldering iron itself without the tip you just slide the tip in like this Tighten down the screw, just needs a little bit and you're good to go. You can also attach the stand like so and now you have it securely on your desk. I did have a wire that uses the stan standard 5.5 millimeter plug goes in here. You also have a USB port. With that you can upgrade the firmware. This is open source on the web page of Banggood. You can find all the necessary manuals. You have the English manual, you have a schematic diagram and the open source code. So you can edit it as you wish. The upgraded model comes in this brown casing which looks very nice and let me turn it on this is version 2.1.2 .2. and to turn it on you just press this button and you see the temperature rising default setting is 300 degrees celsius and the time it needs to go up there is around on 12 volts, around 40 seconds. My power supply has 13.8 volts, I think. So it should be slightly faster than that. So now you're on temperature. And I can show you with some soldering. Solder and this one has a sleep function if you don't use it for the predefined time it goes down to 200 degrees and if you still don't use it it shuts down and if it does go to the sleep as soon as you pick up pick it up and you move it it goes up again in the temperature I ordered this tip so I can, I said it before, I can solder my SMD parts. I did this before I made the video and you can see it's perfectly suitable for that. You can solder your SMD chips with it. I was gonna make this live on video but I'm like two inches away when I solder this 
with my reading glasses on and my handy magnifying glass so you wouldn't have seen much that's what I'm showing you the result so for even the tiniest work you can use this let me turn it off what else should I say can I say oh the grounding wire let me unwrap it quick goes under the screw here just loosen it up slide it underneath and tighten it down again so now you can ground your soldering iron to not destroy any SMD parts that are sensitive The soldering iron runs from 12 to 24 volts as I think I said that before please excuse me it's late at night I had to wait till it's quiet in the house so I can make this without any other noises going into the video the build quality is excellent I was really surprised It has very nice details, as you can see here. USB port. It's very solidly built. The tips will last a long time. So I heard, I haven't tried it that long yet anyhow I don't see any negative parts on this thing it's really nice the one thing I could maybe say that it's a little something I need to get used to is when I pick it up normally I have my trusted Vela soldering iron as you can see it's sturdy because it's getting used every day this I pick up and put it back in with one hand without problem this one if you pick it up like this I cannot solder like that so I have to pick it up and then switch my hand underneath it so I can solder so that's the only negative that I found which is I mean everybody uses his tools differently and this just my thing so I might get a I have to look if there's some stand available like this where you can slide it in then it would be perfect and you can set it and forget it because if it stays still without getting used it shuts down not so with the Veller. I have left this on for many many hours because I forgot to turn it off. Anyhow, but it still survived. Anyhow, if you have any questions about this soldering iron, please let me know. You can write your questions in the comments down below. There will be also some links for you. And... Uh, I guess this is it. Thank you Banggood for sending me this to review it. I like it very much. Take care YouTube. See you later.